hey, does it happen to you? You receive an email with interesting results, but you cannot do anything with them. You would like to do something with them. So what do you do? So you s select the image, you download the image, and now you go in Excel. So you're going to create a new Excel file from scratch here. And I'll show you a feature that I just discovered that's pretty interesting. It's in the data tab. You can, you know, take a picture of whatever, if it's a table, and ask Excel to recognize what's in the picture. And then AI will do the rest for you. So AI identify what's in the picture. It tells you, okay, I discovered that. And everything that is uh, in red means there might be a need for review. So there, here, obviously, it's not dot point twenty-four. So I change. Um, here it's okay, looks okay. Here another mistake. I don't know why there's a dot. Maybe the picture was not great. Here another mistake. I accept the change. And the rest here, oh, here is a parenthesis is missing. Accept. Okay, so far everything looks fine. I accept this one. I accept the title. I accept that. I might not need this, so I'm going to just delete it. And accept okay looks good looks good everything looks good the titles the first column I don't know why it looks suspicious but to me it looks okay so now I insert data and it's gonna say oh you didn't review everything I say okay that's fine and and I have my table so just missing the column here so I'm gonna call it products and I'm going to select this, make it a table. Oh, there were some mistakes I didn't see. Let me correct them. We can still correct them after. OK, and now I'm selecting my table, make it a table. There are areas, yes, and boom, I have a table and now I can play with it. You know, I can filter, um, and maybe I can ask Copilot to help me. And so there was a mistake here, column in one, as you can see, so I might need to revise that. So, you know, there are some AI makes obviously some mistakes. So let's see if Copilot makes mistakes too. Uh, so maybe before doing that, I'm going to change this name of Colin. Um, what was it? In email, it was called Constant Currency Impact. I don't know what it means. Constant Currency Impact. Constant Currency Impact. And I'm going to ask... I need to be in the table to ask something. I'm going to ask sort constant currency impact. Obviously, I can do it manually. But there are some things that are more difficult. why it's doing that I'm gonna expand this it's sorted so it works well so can I ask other things like format negative cells in red and bold can you do that 
that will take time for me to go look at, especially if it was long, but to look at all the the cells that are negatives and put them in red. Maybe I can sort, uh, that's another way to fix it, but I cannot sort every column at the same time. So yeah, probably it's it gonna help me. Woo! Do you, don't you find this amazing? So pretty quickly, I was able to import an Excel, uh, uh, an image, make it an Excel, and then with the help of Copilot, you know, highlight some things that will have take, taken a lot of time if I had to make that manually especially if the file is big obviously the file cannot be big because it's a picture but you understand the benefit of ai here are two ais there's normal ai which recognize an image transform it in excel file the second is copilot to help me to work on those uh, data hope this was insightful <laughs>